Hey folks, welcome to Apple Tech page. In this tutorial, I will show you how to fix iPhone or iPad disabled try again in one minute error. Your iPhone or iPad get disabled if you try to unlock your device too many times with wrong attempts. Solution 1 is remove the lock via iTunes. First, connect your iPhone or iPad to Mac or PC. If your Mac is running with macOS Catalina or later, then open Finder. If your Mac is running with macOS Mojave or earlier or Windows, then open iTunes. Next, locate your device on Finder or iTunes. If you want to backup your device before restoring, click on Backup Now and enter your password. Wait until the backup process is complete. Once the backup process is done, click on Restore iPhone or iPad. Again, click on Restore in the pop-up window. You have to wait until the process is done. Once done, set up your device as new. Solution 2 is remove the lock via iCloud. To start this process, you should know your Apple ID and password and you must enable find my iPhone or iPad feature on your device already. Then only you do this method. If it's not turned on, you will not be able to use this method. Next, you should connect your device to network. First, go to iCloud.com on your web browser. Then sign into your account by giving your Apple ID and password. Next, click on find iPhone. Then click on all devices. Here, find and click on your disabled iPhone or iPad from the list. Next, click on erase iPhone or iPad. Again click on erase. Once this process is done, you can unlock your iPhone. Solution 3 is remove the lock using recovery mode. First, what you have to do is connect your iPhone or iPad to Mac or PC. Next, open Finder or iTunes according to your Mac OS version. Now force restart your device to get into recovery mode. If you are using iPhone 8 and later models or iPad without home button, then do the following steps to force restart. First, quickly press and release the volume up button. Next, quickly press and release the volume down button. Finally, press and hold the side or power button until you see the recovery mode screen. If you are using iPhone 7 and 7 Plus, then do the following steps. Press and hold the sleep or wake button and volume down button at the same time until you see the recovery mode screen. If you are using iPhone 6s Plus and earlier models or iPad with home button, then do the following steps to force restart. Press and hold the home button and side or power button at the same time until you see the recovery mode screen. Once your device is get into recovery mode, locate your device in Finder or iTunes. Now select Restore from the pop-up window. Wait until the process is complete. To exit from recovery mode, force restart your device again. Once done, set up your device as new. Thanks for watching. Do like, share and subscribe to Apple Tech page.